Now this is what y'all have been waiting for, right? Of course, it's time for my end of season awards. This is where I shout out some players who have caught my eye during a ridiculous world tour season. Trust me, this is gonna be fun. Let's get started. A unique award this year. Uh, my player with the best shoe game. Normally we, we look at the sneaks and I say, just based off of style, what do I like? But I'm going to go with the most creative use of shoe game this year. That goes with my guy, Zigi Manta Scuchas of Team Utena Uni Club. My guy tried to block a shot with a shoe. Where they do that at? I got to give him an award just for that alone. He gets my best shoe game of the year award. Jill the Thrill, Jill Martin of Team Losan. Hey, he was in his back like Halloween candy this year. Any defender standing in front of him, their ankles was in major jeopardy. He was a walking highlight reel. He was zero to 100 real quick. He got one speed, is fast all the time. Maybe the toughest player in the game to guard. So as they say, big things come in small packages. Jill Martin, keep them handles rolling, bro. This is the biggest award that you can have. And uh, deservedly so, it goes to my guy, Norris Miezis, MVP of the Doha Masters. You can look at all the numbers, uh, number one in player value, number one in key assists, number one in highlights. We talk a lot about Batman, deservedly so, but if Robin was not considered a superhero before, he better be considered a superhero now. Norris Miezis, he's a top player in the game. In Doha, Carlos Las Manas. Um, that was Las Manas now. Over to Krumis, back to Las Manas. He jabs left, puts the two up on the logo. Can you believe it? That game it was so crazy. Remember, I had to broadcast from my home. I actually had a neighbor come over to my house and knock on my door because I went so crazy on that shot and asked me, could I keep it down? Because I'm broadcasting at like three in the morning. But I didn't even care. That shot was so crazy, I won't ever forget it. This is not gonna be an individual award. This is gonna be a team award. And I'm gonna go with Utena Uni Club. This uh, new Lithuanian team has kinda stole the show. They were a perpetual competitor. We did see them make it to the final of the Deverson Masters. We finished third at the Doha Masters, also got to the semifinals at the World Tour Final. They got a team full of straight killers on that squad, whether it be Scooches or Viatkus. These dudes can get it done. I don't think Utena Uni Club is going anywhere anytime soon. It came in the final tournament, the World Tour Final, and it came courtesy of my guy on Amsterdam, Julian Yaring, we call him JJ, we call him Juice. He showed some bounce going baseline and he banged on the Lithuanian Rodman. Dennis Rodman wouldn't be proud of that, but uh, Julian Jaring, <laughs> he put him on a poster. Okay, and for my final award, you know I gotta go with one of my Filipino homies. Josh Moonzone, you can't blink. He's gonna do something ill to somebody if you do. Every time he steps on the court, you know he's always gonna play with that extra swag, that, that extra pizzazz. He's gonna be in the top five plays, one way or the other. He's not embarrassed to embarrass you. That's my kind of guy.